Hello, in this video, I show you the only way left for regular guys, gals like you and me to solve this problem. Hey, what's up YouTube entrepreneurs? For those of you that are driving for Uber Eats, uh, I don't know if you're aware of the new um, Superior Court laws that basically states that you are an independent contractor so that you are not an employee of Uber Eats. Uber, you're an independent contractor. So as an independent contractor, that means that you are a business. And so I'm going to teach you how to protect yourself as a business and reduce your business taxes. Also understanding uh, driving for Uber, Uber Eats, okay, the expense of your vehicle, you're the one that's going to be paying for that. For us, the wear and tear on your vehicle, the gas, replacing the tires, all of that income comes out of your personal income. And so since you are now classified as an independent contractor, setting yourself up as a business, now these expenses becomes a business tax write-off. Okay. Also, with you properly setting yourself up as a business and Uber Eats pays the business, then you're creating documentation that you can help use to qualify you for a home loan to help you get into a better transportation or even helping you get qualified for business funding without a personal guarantee. Now, the first thing you must do as an independent contractor and driving for Uber Eats, you need to set yourself up as a corporation because you're se separating yourself from the business. So that way, any type of liability is created while you're driving for Uber Eats. That liability is under your business and not on you, so they're not coming after your personal assets. Also, having Uber Eats pay the money to your business checking account instead of to you as the individual. What it does, it builds up your business credit. It builds up your business bank rating. It also builds up your business financials. As well as setting yourself up as the corporation, having that income paid to the corporation is going to reduce your tax liability. And because of the new tax law, setting yourself up as a corporation, then your taxes are going to be much lower than you uh, operating as an individual, okay? Or operating as self-employed. Now you're able to take those business uh, bank documents as well as your business taxes and, again, leveraging those so that you can get qualified for a home loan get qualified to buy your new car, to get qualified for business funding to help continue to grow your business. That's the reason three-way funding, we teach you about setting yourself up as a corporation, teaching you how to get your EIN number, teaching you how to use the corporation to minimize your tax liability so you keep more money in your pocket. We also introduce you to marketing platforms to help you find better quality of Customers, you might want to grow the business or whenever you're in a position to where you may want to work for more than one uh, independent company besides Uber Eats. You may want to work for Uber itself. You also want all this income paid to your corporation. Again, minimizing the tax liability on your personal side, but keeping more money in your pocket. And if you're ready to learn more about how to build your business credit, how to build your corporate credit, what's the difference between business credit? What's the difference between corporate credit? How to be able to get qualified for funding without using your personal guarantee? Click the link below and check out three-way funding. Thank you. I changed my life completely by using this system. Please do yourself a favor and try it out. I know you'll be amazed.